What's going on YouTube, Fezify Media, a story I covered way back and everyone was blowing it up on social media, I actually got removed from this channel so I can't post the footage but basically a man took a young girl from school and someone luckily was filming it and stopped the man in the process and called him out. I'm going to post it on my Instagram to show you guys the footage of what happened because it got removed from YouTube last time but just to raise awareness and show the situation before we talk about it. Now, he was named as Caden Nelson and there was a manhunt for him. Everyone was looking for him and some people was even going to take it into their own hands because it was so disgusting what he did. And now he has actually pleaded guilty to taking that young girl from school. It was said that a young girl was walking to school in Mitcham, London, which is near me, when she was targeted in a horrific attack in November last year. Caden Nelson, 27, today admitted a kidnap, an R charge and making a threat to take a life. It was said that he told her to take off her coat and school blazer before forcing her to do stuff. The court heard he had followed the schoolgirl before creeping up behind her and putting one hand over her mouth and another on her head. He then threatened to take her life and forced her to walk towards an alleyway in Mitcham. The girl had been on the phone chatting to a friend about her homework when she was targeted at 7am. Police were alerted when a woman who was filming the incident called 999 stating that her daughter had seen a man grab a young girl. This woman literally deserves a medal Guys, a family member of the woman went out to check what had happened and managed to interrupt Nelson. When she questioned him, he told her that the victim was his sister. The victim then managed to signal that she needed help before police arrived and Nelson fled, leaving the victim wearing his jacket. The prosecution was able to present compelling evidence that made it clear it was Caden Nelson who carried out this sickening attack. The prosecution case included video footage and DNA evidence from the lighter and tobacco pouch found inside Nelson's jacket pocket, which he left behind. The victim was able to identify him in an ID parade. These guilty pleas will mean that Nelson's young victim will be spared the ordeal of giving evidence in court. I would like to thank the members of the family who saw what happened and took quick action in alerting the police to the incident. The young victim has shown remarkable courage during these proceedings and I hope this conviction will go some way in providing her with closure. It is a very dramatic incident and a lot for a youngster to take in and after that, everyone was being extra safe for their kids taking him to school and it was just crazy to see that happen on video live and luckily that hero was there to actually help and prevent the situation going any further I'm not gonna lie, I've seen people get medals for doing a lot less good things in this world. The lady that stopped this sicko going any further should be awarded with something, I don't know what. The lady who saved a young girl is called Ashante and on social media, Shans Daya is her username and K-Trap actually dropped her a thank you message saying that she'd done everyone proud. The card said, that was proper brave what you done, everybody proud of you, have a good Xmas. And she said, just wanna say a big thank you to k trap for personally dropping this to my house like i said already i only did what i thought needed to be done we all have to protect our young females not gonna lie a lot of people would see a situation like this and just not get involved and when they ask the question of what are you doing and the person said it was their sister still would just walk away after and be like oh, okay but she sent something was wrong and actually had the guts to pursue anything could happen to her in that situation that is one brave act and this girl needs to get all the respect in the world shout out to her now that he's pleaded guilty to what he did what would you guys sentence him to comment below we're trying to push towards 150k a lot more videos coming i'm gonna upload again today guys so make sure you smash that subscribe button to show your support with a notification bell i'll see you on my next one peace out